Hi, I am Marco from the It's Me team. We have developed a web tool that allows you to interact with our community using the stories and venues metaphor. We call it the It's Me emulator and I'll show you how it works. Members of the community come to our website to read and submit posts, make bookmarks and fans, send private messages and so on. Quite a lot of things, right? In the emulator you can add everything that fits together in the right place. It's what we call a venue. Here are two venues for two sample stories, one about the It's Me project, the other about the scenario of the workstation market. I can move venues around and view them in compact or extended form. Just click on title to switch. With single channel view I can see better what's inside the channel and then switch back. With time a lot of elements can go into venues. Finding what I need instantly is easy with the filtering option. Let's say I want to look for a post I wrote about the emulator. Here it is. Only relevant elements are inside. And now, let's see the five channels, one by one. People channel, all the contacts related to the story, are here. To view the details of a person, simply click on the name. They are shown in profile preview, like this. People come automatically from posts and messages, and I can add new contacts from the community, or simply by picking from my fan list. Here's Roberta. Right click, add to venue, and here she is. Let's send a message to Roberta. Right click, choose the option, type. and send. A copy of the message remains in the message channel and our replies will be delivered here as well. Let's move on to the posts channel. Here I can see posts written or bookmarked by me on the It's Me website. I can read the post by clicking on its title or I can make a new post for the website. Simply click on plus and write it. I'll submit the post for publication and the draft stays in the channel. It will be reviewed and published by our staff. Next is Media Channel, with all the images, videos and slides used in the posts. I can preview any file without opening any post. Last, the RSS channel, where I can read feeds coming from other websites, like the news feed from my favorite blog. I can subscribe our community topics or see more either searching or adding a feed manually. I'll add one from the suggested ones. Here we go. I am Marco from the It's Me team. We are testing the emulator, refining it and gathering feedback. Let us know what you think about it, of course, on itsme.it.